After nine months of push and pull between Suai Bufal and Pa Omar Fal, it prompted a peaceful demonstration that was organized by the family of Suai Bufal and his supporters. The demonstration took place from Kusal to Latri Kundayiringanya in a bid to show their grievance, stating that the leadership belonged to Suai Bufal. We the people of Latikunda Yiringanya are not happy and we will not stop with this fight. We will go to the end. What we are interested in is for the leadership to return to where it belongs. When you go to the local government act, an imam cannot pick an alcalo. Instead an alcalo picks an imam. Why should the imam insist that he will pick an alcalo? This caused chaos in the mosque when this issue was raised which prompted the case to be taken to the council. The council called me and Pa Omar to know who will step down but I was followed by a huge crowd and when Pa Omar saw that he said he was not going to be part of the meeting and that he was going to look for a crowd too. This prompted him to leave the council and he never came back. Dudu Sise, a resident of Latri Kunda gave a background information about the issue. Problem B. This problem started since the Ramadan when our Imam Basir announced that he is choosing Pa Omar Fal to be the Alkalo of Latikunda after the death of Alkalo Amadu Fal and that he was going to hand the Alkalo ship to Pa Omar Fal on the following Friday and on Friday we all met at the main mosque but the people of this community choose Suwaibu Fal because of his honesty and trustworthiness. When asked about whether they had written a petition, this is what he had to say. Mm. Regarding the petition, Pa Omar took it and threw it away. And he did not submit his own saying that when KMC does not choose him, the government will choose him. And what he fails to understand is that we are the ones who put the government in power and this is not about politics. Swebu Fal urged people to stop giving their positions to people to handle it for them, stating that it is one of the reasons why they are in this type of situation. He said the people of Latikuna will not accept what the permanent secretary said. He also said that the permanent secretary bypassed all rules by making their decision that is not in favor of the council and elders of the land. Meanwhile, we tried to get the other side of Pa Omar Fal and his family, but they assured us that they have nothing to say regarding this issue.